The Kinesiology Integrative Physiology Department, basically what I tell people is we study the human body. That's what we do. And um, it, it's become a popular major here because of the students wanting something to do with the health-related fields, but also the uniqueness of having uh, the anatomy lab, the sim man, or even our, our, our student personal training program. Hanover does a really great job of giving us hands-on experience in addition to just like being in the classrooms, we get to experience the anatomy lab, the sim man lab. I think that's something that has really made my experience a lot better, actually being able to like apply things outside of the classroom rather than just like read it in a book or listen to it and then forget it after the exam. You'll work with the sim man your sophomore year in the physiology class or your junior year in the pathophysiology class. Normally it's used in a clinical setting, nursing schools and that type of thing, so we're one of the pioneers in using it in a liberal arts setting. It's a human patient simulator. All right, so what we do with this is it has a pulse, it breathes, the, the pupils dilate, um, it has heart sounds, it has breathing sounds, it has abdominal sounds. You're not going to like this one. <laughs> let's, let's just stick to the coffee. It's a hands-on thing. There's no better way to learn. We obtain six or eight cadavers per academic year. The thing that we do here that's so different is uh, that uh, they do actual dissection. The course is offered through the Kinesiology and Integrative Physiology Department, but we get uh, a good representation from biology, chemistry, physical therapy, occupational therapy, physician assistant, medical school, and uh, strength and conditioning and performance. So that's, you know, you've you got a group of people in here that are you know, have different ambitions of you know, what they're going to use the information for. I've already used it several times. I'll be in the training room with Tony. I'll be like, okay, so is that this muscle or this muscle? And he'll be like, oh, well, it's this one. And I'm like, oh, okay, I just remember being in anatomy lab and going over that one when we were dissecting the other day. It helped me a lot just in the aspect of being able to connect it back to what I want to do in my life of being an athletic trainer or being a physical therapy assistant. I think this is also incredibly applicable to a lot of the students' lives because so many of the Hanover students tend to be student athletes as well. So just being able to really get in touch with that experience and understand all the anatomy that they put to use almost every day as athletes, I think is something really useful for them too. I think being a student athlete, I'm kind of exposed to a lot of the things that we're learning about in kinesiology because it's all about how the body moves, how the body responds to injury, and one of the classes I'm in right now is exercise physiology, so that's kind of basically sums up what I do as an athlete, like we're exercising, and it's cool to see like how the body works and actually know like why your body is doing that and why those things are happening. Like connecting it to everything that I've learned, it helps give a lot more of a visual representation, which helps me a lot personally because I'm a very hands-on learner. I didn't get to do this stuff until I was in my PhD program and I call it aha moments that you know I've read about it, talked about it, looked at pictures but until you actually get to see, touch and feel that um, you know there's, there's so many experiences that you're not going to get out of a book. You get those experiences in your first freshman and sophomore year with like the anatomy lab and you get to be in Horner doing workouts in your classes and your labs and stuff like that and it really gives you a glimpse of what the future could look like. 